Yeah, hello students. Here I am going to explain my interesting problem. Yeah. Let x comma y belongs to closed 0 to 2 pi and satisfying the equation sin cube x plus cos cube y plus 6 times of sin x into cos y equal to 8 then minimum value of x minus y. Okay. So given equation is sin cube x plus cos cube y plus 6 sin x into cos y minus 8 equal to 0. I can rewrite it as sin x cube plus cos y cube so instead of minus 8, I am writing it as plus times of minus 2 q and this plus 6 sin x cos y is written as minus 3 times of sin x into cos y into minus 2 equal to 0. Now this is in the form of now this is in the form of a q plus b q plus c q minus 3abc equal to 0. This happens only when either a, either a plus b plus c equal to 0 or a equal to b equal to c. But in this problem, students observe, this a, a equal to b equal to c never happens because a means here sin x so b means cos y c means actually minus 2 you know that sin x range is minus 1 to 1 cos y range also minus 1 to 1 that's why for any values any value of x and y those values are not equal to minus 2 means that you can rule out this condition now you can take this condition a plus b plus c equal to 0 by using that condition we can solve the problem Okay. Yeah. Now, a plus b plus c equal zero. Here, a means sin x plus b means cos y. C means minus two equal to zero. Or another words, I can say that sin x plus cos y equal to two. Here, you need to observe one thing, students. Sin x maximum value one cos y maximum value 1 because here x and y are different angles. So sin x maximum value 1, cos x maximum value 1, so minimum value minus 1. So their addition should be 2 means indirectly you can say that the sin x should be equal to 1 and cos y also equal to 1 at a time. So what I can say here sin x equal to 1 and cos x cos y equal to 1 then only this equation is true. Okay. That I am going to write here. Students observe. Yeah. So finally, sin x equal to 1 implies actually we are inventing many solutions, but our solution should be in between 0 to pi. Only one solution between 0 to 2 pi which satisfies sin x equal 1 that is pi by 2. So, in other words, I can say that the x value is equal to pi by 2. Next, cos y. Cos y equal to 1. Here also we have infinitely many values for y, but I am going to find only some the values which are in the interval 0 to 2 pi. One of the y value is 0. So because cos, cos 0 is equal to 1. Another value of y is, yeah, that is 2 pi. So that also included because closed interval is given. So what I can say, the possible values of x is pi by 2 and possible y values of 0 to 2 pi. Now I am going to find actually we need to find minimum value of x minus y but both I will find maximum value of x minus y and minimum value of x minus y okay okay students listen yeah sometimes somebody will ask you what is the maximum value of x and y maximum value of x and y means here maximum angle of x is pi by 2 and maximum value of y is 2 pi add them get maximum x plus y max z x plus y you can say right like that Max z of x plus y equal to 2 pi plus pi by 2. That is equal 5 pi by 2. 
okay now minimum minimum of x minus y to find minimum of x minus y your y should be maximum x should be minimum okay so that's why minimum value of x is here y by 2 only only one value minus maximum value of y among 0 and 2 by 2 by is maximum so now what i can say here minimum value of x, min, x, x minus y is pi by 2 minus 2 pi or another so i can say that minus 3 pi by 2 therefore my conclusion is here the minimum value of x minus y is mi, minus 3 pi by 2 and maximum value of x plus y is pi pi by 2